Today I'm making eggs baked in a bread boat with herbs and arugula and goat cheese. Just a little handheld breakfast. Let's make it. To start off this recipe, I'm going to delve into my baguette and you wanna cut off this top layer. Don't go too deep because you don't want it to be too shallow and then the eggs bake and they roll and you know, it bubbles over. You don't want that to happen. So just the very top. This is a sourdough baguette. You could do two mini baguettes. You could do a seeded baguette. Whatever you want, whatever flavor you like. Now this inside part we are going to dig out. And luckily I have tiny little squirrel fingers so they just dig right in here. I also like this because it's an easy way to feed a lot of people. You could do a couple of these and then just slice them up and for brunch or whatever, have some bacon on the side or a bowl of fruit. This is an easy way to make breakfast for a crowd. Okay, now that I have my little egg boat ready, I'm going to make the filling, which is eggs, some cream, salt and pepper, herbs, lemon. Like I said, you can add whatever herbs you like. You can add bacon. You can add whatever cheese you like. These are just the flavors I prefer. But the, the possibilities are endless. You can kind of do whatever you want for this. A little salt. Pepper. A little cream. And the zest of one lemon it brightens up the flavors. Now onto the herbs. Chives, mild onion flavor. You wanna finely mince these. If you have some leftover cooked, like ground up meat or turkey sausage or pancetta or something, that would be really good in this. Some flat leaf parsley, just the leaves. And I have some basil. Like I said, you can use whatever herbs you want. You could use rosemary, thyme, sage. Whisk it together. This is ready. I'm just pouring it into a liquid measure with the spout. It just makes it easier to pour into the baguette. Let's put it together. Sheet pan. Make sure you find one that fits on a sheet pan because if anything overflows, you don't want it in the bottom of your oven. Arugula. You could use spinach. Just kind of tuck it in. Let's pour the mixture into this little well. To finish it off, I have some goat cheese that I'm just going to chunk into little pieces and stick it on top of the eggs. And to finish it off so it gets nice and golden brown and gorgeous in the oven, I'm gonna drizzle a little extra virgin olive oil over everything. All right, I'm gonna bake this 350 for 20, 25 minutes. It just depends. You want, when you squeeze it like this, it not to be gooey, the egg to be set, and for the bread to be nice and golden brown. It's ready. Ooh, it looks gorgeous. Doesn't that look pretty? The egg is set, still a little warm. But you can see when you squeeze it together, it's set. <laughs> All right, to slice this up, I'm just gonna have three inch pieces or so. Ooh. And I'll plate this up. some of the herbs that I put in the actual baguette, I'm just gonna sprinkle on top. And there you go. Eggs baked in a bread boat with herbs and lemon and goat cheese. An easy handheld breakfast. Mmm. Make it.